the morning and follow up. So very along the boardwalk. Stayed at Aquarius last night. That was part of the Best Western program and we try to usually stay at Best Western to get points. <coughs> so Boston's uh, interesting. I call it Boston and River Holy well, City. Rivertown, because it's right along the Colorado River. So, see the sun coming up over there. Here's their dinner boat that you can take out tonight. It's like $89 for dinner, walking down the river. They have a jet boat down a little ways that you can take from Laughlin, clear down to Lake Havasu to London Bridge also, which is like $89, I think, too. So, a couple things to do. You can rent jet skis here. Um, River's not really, you can tell, uh, they drop the river at night, so you can see the, down along the side here, it gets uh, a little shallower, and then they raise it back up during the day, so it's a little different than <clears throat> down by the Parker Strip, where we used to have a place, water doesn't fluctuate much down there. So, got a um, shoot Edgewater along here, and Aquarius, and Riverside. There's a, quite a few different hotels you can stay at. They all have pools. Um, they have a nice pavilion for concerts too, across the street. We've been there before for a concert. Usually, you don't see many concerts here in Lawson, so it cools off. It's still 100 degrees, so. But here, coming up, I think I've seen, I think some concerts will be starting up here by the end of uh, September, maybe. October. But, um, quite a few hotels. Uh, not very busy during this time of year just because of the heat still but you can get a deal during the weekdays on a room pretty reasonable so do recommend me if you get a chance come out toward the end of summer during the weekdays you can get a pretty good deal on a room so river is calm this morning it's it's nice out so we're across the river you can see bullhead city so Take care and have a wonderful day and try not to be out so in between videos so long, but I haven't been doing too much. I've been staying in uh, Phoenix with my uh, son, so uh, we'll be heading back that way. And then I think we're going back down to the Ozarks. I got a couple doctor's appointments to finish up with in, in Phoenix. That's one thing I guess people should think about too uh, as you get older. But if you're thinking about living someplace, I guess, better look at what those towns have for healthcare facilities. I know a lot of us don't really want to live in big cities anymore. I don't know I live in big cities, but usually can get into a facility, you know, you need anything from, you know, dentist or whatever, dermatologist, heart doctor, you get into some of these, I noticed when we were down in Ozarks, I'm not bashing Ozarks, but, uh, you know, if, if you, down there, you got a three hour drive to Kansas City, or three hour drive to St. Louis. If you live in a bigger city, you know, you can get an appointment a lot faster, I think, than you can in a small town. You don't get a lot of choose from in a small town. So, just uh, putting that out there for people thinking about moving, that's one thing that's still kind of holding me up about moving to a small town is as we get older and health issues, uh, or you can get in to see somebody. <clears throat> Anyways, it's a beautiful morning.
So everybody have a great day. Take care.